What's going on you guys? So another Dale Line Spartan 3020. This will be a teardown video. So what I'm gonna do is move the thumb screw in the back. There's one on the top, one on the bottom. And you're gonna slide the side cover panel to the left. And if you guys are asking me why am I wearing gloves, uh, the reason why I'm wearing gloves, there are a lot of sharp edges around the corner of the PC, so you're gonna be going around upgrades or, or doing tear down. You actually can get cut pretty quick, like right here, see the sharp edges. So I do recommend wearing gloves, but if you, you don't want to, you don't have to. So I'm gonna move the first is the front cover plastic. It's got clips, you see that? One here in the top, one in the middle, one in the bottom. I'm just gonna slide like this. And it's got a one screw you gotta remove here for the for the hard drive cage. To move this right here. Uh, there's one screw here in the top and the bottom also for the cage for the three and a half inch. Just like that. Now what I will do is there's another screw you have to remove. Looks like another one here. That's for the look like our SD card reader. What I'll do is I'm gonna remove the RAM. This one screw you have to remove right here on the top. Also want to screw here on the top also where the power switch is at. You guys asking why the tear down? Basically the tear down is like if you guys have already bought a used computer and it has a lot of dust inside, it'd be the perfect way to take it whole part, clean it up, put it back inside. So it looks like, let me look at the There's another screw you have to remove for the card reader in the top, right here. You see that? There's another screw you have to remove. It just comes out. Now, what I will do is I'm going to disconnect the power supply. It's an 8 pin SATA cables. I'm going to move the SSD. This is comes out it's just like this lift it up it comes out like that so this is a wireless card wireless card right here for Wi-Fi and you will have to use a mini Phillips head to remove it see that same one as you removed for the SSD You see that yeah, they're not the same size. This is like a smaller one. This is a lot bigger for, for the Phillips head. This comes out. There's another screw you have to remove right here for this whole plate. This is for the hard drive cage. And 
There's another screw you have to remove in the bottom right here. And it comes out like this. See that? This is for the power for the optical drive and the SATA hard drive. Now what I'll do is remove the video card. You see that there's a clip right here. You guys probably can't see it. Okay. You see there's a clip right here, a blue one. You gotta lift it up your hand like this. Lift up the, the pin, secret clip, and lift the video card. Just like that. The video card comes out. It's using a low profile. You see that? This is the clip you have to lift it up right here. Hold your finger. Because this will a little pin, secure pin, prevent for video card coming out. So what I will do is try to move this fan shroud. And you gotta use a flathead screwdriver. You see that? It's got clips. So you have to go around with the clip with the flathead screwdriver like this. Lift them up like that gently, like see right here? It's got clips on each side, each corner has clip. So you have to right here use a flathead screwdriver. So now what we'll do is uh, we'll disconnect the power supply for pin for the CPU. And disconnect the power supply, the three, the three screws are in the back. Power supply slides to the right, comes out a 180 watt. It's got a small fan in the back. I'm not sure. It looks like it's a 40 millimeter. Looks like it. So now what I'll do, guys, is I'll pull the motherboard out. We'll start from the bottom. Screws here. Looks like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, one, two, okay, so let me count again. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So it looks like seven screws you have to remove. Before I do that, I'm gonna disconnect the four pin CPU. Looks like it's a four pin, four wire for the fan, CPU fan. And I'm gonna disconnect the, the cooler first before I pull the motherboard out. I'm using left hand so you guys can see the view better because if I use a wire right hand, you guys is blocking the view. Now what I'll do is I need to take a paper towel and wipe down the thermal cam panel. And I'll be using 91% uh, rubbing alcohol. Just put a small amount of paper towel like this. Just like that. Wipe it off. Leave the CPU uh, in the motherboard before I'll pull the motherboard out, then I'll move the CPU. The 
one screw here in the right. You see that right here with the, with the eight pin CPU power? And there's, another, and there's one here in the top corner also the screw. There's one screw here in the left, top left corner. So what I'll do is, uh, see that the top one is a PC. This is for the power switch, power LED corner. You gotta remove, disconnect from the motherboard. And also looks like you have to remove the thumb screw for the SSD. This is the standoff you have to remove. I'm gonna remove that one. Cause that's actually connected right here. Don't forget you gotta remove it. Also, this is uh, for the SSD standoff mounting screw. You also have to remove before you're gonna pull the motherboard out. And you're just gonna grab right here with your hand like this. Gently, okay, so there's another screw right here. I forgot. See the, the ram is right in the middle? There's another screw here. Now you can pull the motherboard out. So the motherboard looks like. It's like a micro ATX but wider. Move the back side. And remove the CPU. So the way you do that, just take like this your finger. Pull the CPU out like that, gently. And will be the last part is, I'm gonna remove the power switch right here. You see that's mounted to the case. Again, I gotta take a flathead screwdriver. And the way it comes out, It's got clips in the bottom and the top. You see that? And it comes out like just like that. So there's a clip on the top and the bottom and it comes out, this is the power switch. See you guys this being the video. Thanks for watching, bye.